the gameplay of Dragon Ball Z Fighter borrows concepts from several other fighting games, primarily the Marvel vs. Capcom series control scheme and team mechanics. Players each select three characters to form a team. One character is controlled and can be switched with one of the other characters at any time. Players can also call one of their other characters to perform an assist move, allowing simultaneous attacks and combos with the entire team. All three of the opponent's characters must be defeated to win the game. The Universal Vanish and Dragon Rush moves resemble the Roman cancel system commonly found in Arc System Works games and Guilty Gear XRD S Dust attacks respectively, while the Super Dash move resembles the homing system of Arcana Heart. Players can also key charge to manually increase their super meter, similar to previous Dragon Ball fighting games. In addition, as the fight progresses, players gather the Dragon Balls one by one. So far there is not much information on the conditions for attaining them, but once all seven are assembled by a player, Shenron appears to grant a wish, and allows players to choose one among the following benefits increasing the fighter's strength, revive a fallen ally, recover a fighter's health or increase resistance to damage. The January issue of Shuisha's V-Jump magazine revealed on November 21st that Gotenks, Kid, BUU, and Ultimate Gohan would join the roster of playable characters for the game. The game will launch for Xbox One, PlayStation 4, and PC via Steam in the Americas and Europe on January 26. People who pre-order the game digitally will receive early access to the game's open beta for PS4 and Xbox One early access to Super Saiyan Blue Goku and Super Saiyan Blue Vegeta with two exclusive lobby avatars and a girl's stamp pack with Android 21, Android 18 and Bulma at launch. The game's Ultimate Edition will include the Fighter's Pass, a music pack with 11 songs from the anime, and a commentator voice pack. The Fighter's Pass will include 8 additional playable characters that will be released after launch, and it will also be available for purchase separately. Bandai Namco Entertainment America and Europe will also release a collector's edition that will bundle a Goku statue, three artboards, and steel book packaging. The game will launch in Japan on February 1st for PS4 and Xbox One. In the game story mode, as the mysterious clone army invades, the super warriors lose consciousness and the powers. At the same time, the player protagonist becomes mind-linked to Goku. Goku and players must fight together to reveal the mystery behind the Link and the clone army. The story mode will also have two other stories, where the player protagonist becomes mind-linked to Android 18 and to Freezer. The characters Android 16 and new character Android 21 hold the key to the story. Playable characters include Goku, Team Gohan, Vegeta, Future Trunks, Frieza, Cell, Krillin, Piccolo, Android 18 with Android 17, Android 16 Yamcha, Tien Shinyan with Chiaosu, Majin Buu, Gohan, Cell, Nappa, Jinyu, Gotenks, Kid Buu, and Ultimate Gohan. The game is also adding an original playable character designed by Akira Toriyama named Android 21, who is described as a scientist possessing intelligence rivaling drive. Jero, what are your thoughts? Have you pre-ordered it yet? Let me hear you guys out in the comments so you can get connected with me on Snapchat Vibes 16 and Instagram. Stay tuned.